concyclic points. Take a line segment PQ and two points R and S on the same side of the line. Now join R with P and Q and S with P and Q. If angle PRQ is equal to angle PSQ, then all the four points will be concyclic and the circle will pass through point S. Come on, let us prove it. Now, it is given that angle PRQ is equal to angle PSQ. Let us assume that we can draw a circle intersecting points P, Q and R. But, in reality, it does not intersect point S. Now, look at the image. We know that angle PRQ and angle PSQ are equal and are located at point T of the circle. Therefore, angle PRQ must be equal to angle PTQ because angles in the same segment are equal. If we compare with equation 1, then we can say that angle PSQ is equal to angle PTQ. Look at the image carefully using the exterior angle property of the triangle STQ. We can say that angle PSQ is equal to the sum of the angle PTQ and angle STQ is equal to the sum of angle PTQ and angle STQ. What we have achieved is that angle PSQ was in fact equal to angle PTQ, which looks like a paradox. The only way to find a solution for this will be that S and T are coincident to each other. Therefore, this means that S was actually located on the circle. Hence, we have proved that P, Q, R and S are concyclic.